All right. Playing a little Madden Ultimate Team. I'm in the uh, – made it to the playoffs. I'm in the, um, the championship game now. Not the Super Bowl. And it's not really – it's the NFC Championship. They call it the NFL Championship. But it's a championship game. And um, it's me against the Niners. I don't know. What, I don't know what um, how the Niners play in Ultimate Team as far as like their hit power and all that and getting ridiculous interceptions. I, I don't think it's the same as it would be against uh, if you were playing regularly online. So I'm not too worried about you know bullshit fumbles and um, you know faggot interceptions because it's not it's not the true 49ers team. So I'm glad about that. Um, I am excited though. Two reasons. Number one. I'm getting the ball coming out of the halftime, which I love. And I picked up a new wide receiver. I got a new Brandon Marshall. He's an uh, 82 overall. So I got him. I got Ebron. Second down. And I got um, I got Stevie Brown uh, as my safety. And I believe he's an 80 overall. So I, I made a few upgrades since my last game. So this should be pretty good, I think. <clears throat> Yeah, you see, he just hit me with a little underneath route, but I injured, I injured him, so that's good. That's a good job. And he dropped it too, which is good. So I got him third and long. I thought he completed that, but he dropped it. So he's got third and long. No doubt about it. And um, we can get off the field quickly here and put our stamp on his game right off the bat. That'll be good. You never, you never know what kind of offense a guy's going to play based on their first drive. I always like to, um, I always judge it by, you know. Probably the third drive, because then they kind of know what they're doing. It, there you see him with a double crossing route. It was pick your poison as far as that goes. And he's got uh, Matt Ryan as, as his quarterback. And um, Percy Harvin was his receiver that just got injured, so he's out of the game. And you still couldn't make the play. I think he's... Oh, uh, no, actually, I'm sorry. He just came back. He, he came back in. But... Um, after the long game, let's see what they do. I'm not. Really, I'm not too. Really, I don't. I know a lot of guys. They use these. Uh, these running quarterbacks. Matt Ryan's not one of them, so I'm not too worried about getting caught with a uh, QB run. Even if he runs, he's not going to get you know gas me for a huge gain like he would if he was like RG3 or um, Cam Newton or something like that. So I'm not too worried about that. And. Um, he did convert a big third down with that crossing route, so I, I really want to, you know, try and hold him down to at least a field goal here. I'm in pretty good position, like I said, because if he scores here, uh, and he just, he just killed me with a big run up the middle. Um, with, uh, LaShawn McCoy is his running back, so no surprise there why he gassed me for a big run. Um, but I'm still in, I'm still in good position because even if he scores. I could score and then get the ball coming out of half and take a lead. Hopefully, if I, you know, if I can do uh, something on offense. Now, after picking up the first on the ground. Now this guy is. Looks like he's kind of milking the clock a little bit because he's not hurrying up to the line. Um, he's he's taking his time. He's got Demarco Murray too, so he's got a good running game. Uh, he's got two good running backs, McCoy and um, and Murray. That that's a good one-two punch right there. So chances are he's probably not going to do too much on the uh, in the air unless he has to. So I really got to uh, focus in on the run and, and try and shut that down a little bit. And here we have second. And uh, see what happens. But you see what he's doing. He, he's shooting himself in the foot. He's he's playing uh, already. He's playing clock ball. First quarter he's playing clock ball. I don't know why you would do that. I mean to me score first. Get a lead, get an advantage, then you start playing with the clock. But he, he took himself out of a you know second one. Now he's uh, you know second and six. What was a running down, you know, Tim now is a passing down. But he's hit, he's got the zig wide open, and I got him in a sack. Great pressure. So he he basically outthought himself. He basically outthought himself because he played clock ball way too early. Now I got him third and long. And not only third and long, I knocked him out of field goal range. So if I'm him, I'm thinking first, pick up seven or eight yards. Get me back in the field goal range. And then depending on what happens, maybe I go for it on fourth down. I don't know. But he, he, he basically outsmarted himself on that, which I'm fine with. 
this snap. And he's going to try and hit me with that crossing route again, but I jumped the route. I baited him on that. I should have had a pick, but I did stop him. If he's smart, he'll punt the ball, which he is doing. Um, so, all right, we're in good shape now. If I can go down the field and score, I can get the ball coming out of half. I can take a two-touchdown lead and basically put this game away. That is a scary. That is a scary play. That crossing route because you, you really you don't know who to pick on that. Uh, you know who to cover on that. It's basically like I said, pick your poison. But I got the ball. I'm gonna uh, you know try running it a little bit, take a little bit of time off the clock. You know these quarters run fast anyway. I hope I can get something going. I got Reggie Bush as my running back. He's pretty decent. No blocking up front though. No blocking up front. So I just. First carry of the game, and I lose a yard. Defense is in a good situation. That's rough. <clears throat> but I'm, I am going to still, you know, I am going to push with the run. The 49ers will come out. And, and uh, you know, try and pick up something here. There, that, that's that's what I was looking for. That's what I was looking for. It's not great, but it's an eight-yard run. do it anymore. This team, they can power it up in there and pick up those tough yards. I got to convert this, though. I can't, I can't give them a chance to come back. You know, stop me. I fumbled the ball. Nice job. I still got a yard, though. I am going to go for it. Actually, I think I might try to trick him with a fullback run. And we've reached the two-minute warning. And put my uh, put my running back in motion. See if he commits to the run. Fullback runs for you know for a yard are pretty good. Eh. Uh, I don't know. I'm not sure. Not far from a first down, they're gonna go for it. This is a big play right here because I'm taking a I'm taking a really really big gamble. The Giants have really big gamble. And the give to Reggie Bush. Oh, and I paid off. It paid off big time. There's Reggie Bush. Show that speed, baby. Pure determination. <laughs> now, the only drawback to that is I scored too fast. Long running play for a touchdown. I, I scored too fast. Feel like you're stealing something. It takes so I kind of I kind of gave him a good opening to, to still be in the game, but that's fine. I'll play some more defense. It seems to me that he he only has that crossing route as his uh, his safety net play, and if I can keep that bottled up a little bit, oh man, he just juked me out of my shoes, and he's gonna take this back for a touchdown. Wow. Come on, Bob, and get him. Big time return. That is exactly what I did not need. I did not need that right now. He just juked me out of my fucking shoes. Return team, good job. Damn. Look at the speed of that guy running. They get the tackle from behind. Now he's already he's already in field goal range. Offense has a chance to do something with this drive. Demarco. He, he right now, because of what just happened, he could pretty much play his his normal offense and do whatever he wants. He's got all his timeouts. He's got plenty of time. Uh, to make something happen here. He's probably going to try and uh, trick me with a passing play now. I'm not going to bite on it. No, nope, he just went right back to the run. <laughs> and, I, and I hit him, but he falls forward for a first down. And now he's got me stuck in this base defense. I don't like running a three-man uh, a three -man defense, but... Wow, look at that. Okay, just stumbling and, and juking all over the place. Now he's going to slow down a little bit. But there's only so many things the offense... I, I don't think he wants to give me the ball back. He's running safe plays right now, which I can't blame him for. Yeah, he's gonna he's just going to keep pounding me up the middle. And, and even, though I'm, even though I'm hitting him, he's just spinning and fucking falling forward for a goddamn touchdown. I, lo I love that. I love that about Madden, how guys just get hit, and yet they keep spinning and flopping around like a fucking fish and falling forward. Unreal how that happens. And that happens a lot. I understand running backs fight for yards and they, you know, spin and all that kind of stuff, but it's ridiculous. Now, I could have had a really good return right there, but the hole closed really fast. So, I'm still going to run the ball. I got time. I still have three timeouts. I want to hit him with something decent here. Try and get about 10, 15 yards. Oh, man. If my line could block for me, though. Now I gotta burn a timeout on a bullshit play. And that's the first one they've used. That last running play was good for <sighs> Now I gotta go for something big here. It's Bush. This should be okay. Nope. 
because the fucking guy, the should have pass interference. I'm trying to hit my guy over the middle, and uh, the linebacker comes over and just stonewalls him. Where's the illegal contact? Where's the pass interference? This is a big conversion right here. I need it bad. And I just picked it up. Oh, and I'm still going. I'm still going. That's good. Take a timeout. I'm thinking right now field goal. I got to get in the field goal range. That's my first goal right now. The offense is set at the line for the first down. Go up by three and then get the ball coming out of the half. So I don't want to do anything crazy here. Now it's time to back it up. Has his man. Come on, Bush. Outrun that. There you go. There you go. Get out of bounds. Good. Plenty of time in field goal range. <laughs> I don't want to gamble too much. I do want to get a touchdown here. I, I, I'm pretty, I'm, I'm pretty, I'm in good position right now. If this play gets open, it's six. Oh, man, he covered it well, though. But I still caught the ball. I held on to it. Now, basically the way I'm looking at it is I got two shots at the end zone before I have to take a field goal. That's the way I'm looking at it right now. I get, just can't get sacked. If I get sacked, I'm fucked. I, I just blew the whole thing. Hopefully this guy didn't play pitch ball on me, which I don't think he will. Oh! That's one. I got one more shot, then I got to take the field goal. the incomplete pass, it brings up second down. It's an empty backfield for Manning this time. He'll take the snap. This is crucial right here. Just don't get sacked. That's my whole goal right now. And again, I throw the ball out of the fucking end zone. I actually can throw it one more time. Who's willing to fight the hardest? I can actually throw it one more time. Breaking huddle at the six. Ready for intermission. First, one more play. Oh, come on, EA. Now he's gonna yeah, see now he's gonna start playing bitch ball fucking defense, really? Pulling your fucking lineman off the line like that. Absolute horse shit. It didn't affect me. I did score. I'm in great position now. But I hate when guys do that. Just play fucking defense. Stop playing like a faggot. Pulling your fucking guy off the line like that to drop him into coverage. It doesn't take skill to drop all your guys into coverage so you can't throw the fucking ball. I'm sorry. It's bitch ball faggot defense. Not my fault he can't get pressure. Takes it from the and maybe if you rush four instead of three, you get some pressure. I don't know. And the tackles Eli is my quarterback, by the way. I had Aaron Rodgers, um, and I had Blake Bortles. They're, they're my backups right now. Um, but Eli is a higher rated uh, than my other two guys. So <coughs> I got to go I gotta go with the better rated guy, obviously. Now my whole goal here is just to, you know, eat some clock. <laughs> which I guess they don't want me to eat clock, so they're going to let me score, which is nice. Take it to the house, Bush. Take it to the house. Look at that speed. I don't know his overall. I forget his overall. I think he's an 80 overall. But he, um, he's he got great speed. So uh, I think this guy's going to quit. I thought he was going to quit there. I'm glad he didn't. I want to finish this game. Nice job by the wide receivers and everybody. So, I mean, he's an 80 overall, Reggie Bush, but he's got 95 speed. So, once he gets out in the open, chances are nobody's going to catch him. Now, I got, I'm got. i really, really in control of this game. My running game is doing good. My defense got to come up with a nice stop. But it's, it's taking him a while to score. And he, like I said, you guys saw it. He outthought himself uh, in the first quarter. Should never play clock ball like that. Come to the line of scrimmage, first down. That's actually a big drive um, in this game right now because he, he he really killed himself on that. Cover that tight end. See, that that's my goal right now is just to force him to throw those little underneath routes. Don't get don't get beat deep. I got two safeties playing back up top, and. Um, I just I'm gonna get I'm gonna try and limit him to just underneath routes and he's gonna have to make me miss. Ah, oh, yeah, there you go. There's a drop ball, nice hit. Knocked uh, knocked his guy out. That's my Stevie Brown right there. I was just telling you about. He's uh, an 80 overall, but he's got good uh, hit power. 
I hope he's going to be okay. So if I could just li you know limit him, like I said, to underneath routes, he's got nothing. That, that's all. That's all he's got right now. He's going to have to really break tackles and make me miss and and break a big one because I'm not I'm not I'm not going to get let, uh, let him beat me deep. No way. They're going to the hurry up. Back to the line. Throwing now to his left. Oh, okay. Was there? Over the other side of the field. Good job getting the first down by the. Hit me on a slant right there. Ten yards. Could have been could have been a lot worse. But again, he's taken a tremendous amount of time to score. So, I mean, he's got to he's got to score, then stop me, or pray for an onside kick. Oh, give me that interception! Give me that interception, please. That's the game right there. I'll tell you, man. They drop more interceptions in this game than I that I don't know what to do with. I mean, it's right in their hands. I have played a guy earlier today. Uh, I posted that video too, actually. I dropped, I think, seven or eight interceptions. I mean, I should have had ten turnovers in that game. Right in their, right in their hands. And it just dropped all of them. I'm fucking real. So now he's hitting me with those cross. He's trying to hit me with those crossing routes again. He's got nothing. So he's got to go back to a. He, I think he hit him with a curl right there. Good play by him. He needs the conversion. But he's really. I mean, he's eating up the whole quarter right now. Uh, which is great. Which is fine with me. But by rights, this game really should have been over with that. I should have had that interception. Oh, and I get the fumble, baby. That's it. I pretty much just sealed the game. Um, I'm just going to run the ball now. And he's going to have to stop me. <clears throat> he's going to have to stop me get a fumble of his own because I'm not putting the ball in any harm's way. I'm not taking no chances. I'm not going to eat the clock and milk it like a bitch. But I am going to play somewhat of a clock ball. And I'm going to have to throw the ball if shit like that keeps happening. I mean, I shouldn't complain. Six carries, 152 yards. But... Give me some blocking. The only reason I even got those runs is because I made it to the outside. So, I'm going to try it again. Oh, man. I got to throw it here, but the quarter's over. I'm going to take the, you know, play it into the fourth quarter. If I don't get it, no big deal. I'll punt it away. Because there's no way in, in three minutes he's coming back with two scores. And not only that, two scores, he's gonna have to then that's only gonna tie the game. So this guy's pretty much fucked. Now I want this play to get open so bad. I'm going for Ebron here if it gets open. But he's I get oh, I get sacked. Worst thing that could happen right now is getting sacked. Actually I shouldn't say that. Well, that's the worst it's not the worst thing, because I just punted away. Make him, he's gonna have to go to length of the field, score, get an outside kick and score again to just tie the game. So I'm not too worried about it. I got this game pretty much in hand. I give the guy credit though. He is sticking. He is sticking in there. He's not quitting. And he's pulling all those guys away from the ball. Why would you do that? You just let it bounce another 30 yards. And not only that, you, more seconds tick off the clock. That's that's fine with me. Like I said, that's twice now. He's just outsmarting himself. I he was probably worried he was gonna um, touch the ball and have it you know roll as a fumble, but still. You can't take that chance. I'd rather chance to fumble and not lose an extra 30 yards. That's ridiculous. Can't find the target on the Hit him while he threw, so he's got nothing there. <clears throat> I'm just, again, I'm just playing coverage D. I got everybody back in coverage. Um, I'm, I'm still bringing pressure up, to, you know, with my defensive line. Can't let him stand back there all day. Come on, get off the block. There you go. Hit him. Down. Sacked him. Third and 25. He's got nothing. Chances are probably he's going to quit after this game. On his left side, there's nothing he can do, and he goes down for the sack. Coming to the line, hoping to avoid being sacked for a third. At least it's not the Niners um, of 13, thank God. Give me this pick. Give me that pick. He caught that off a bullshit bounce. A, a bullshit. To See, again, another dropped interception. This one now. Another dropped interception. Motherfucker, man. Boy, they, they, you know, they just want to give a guy a fucking break and keep him in a goddamn game. I swear to God, that's their whole fucking deal. Another. That should have been a pick. 
right in that situation. I mean, yeah, three guys jumping for the ball. Someone's got to catch it. Luckily, they didn't give him a circus catch because they, they like to do that. God damn, just give me my fucking interceptions, man. They're legit. Looking long. Another one. Another dropped interception. That play because when you come get on off the field, get a turnover and get the offense off the field. Not only that, my defensive line, I'm getting there. I'm getting pressure, but I'm just missing as far as sacks. I'm just missing. And he's standing back here all day with you know having a fucking cup of coffee. To pick up the first. Play number six coming up on this drive. Four interceptions though. Jesus. I understand I'm gonna win the game. The game's over. He needs a lot to happen to even tie the game. But come on. Matt Ryan. Fucking keep a guy in the game. Another one. <laughs> I mean, come on. How many fucking free chances do you want to give a guy? And the guy dropped it. You just go, yes, I got a break. Now can you capitalize? Man, you know, they, they, they make this shit just way off. No, NFL players are not going to drop that many passes that hit them right in the fucking hands. Whether they play on defense or not. They're not going to drop that many that, that, that many balls. I'm sorry, it's just not going to happen. They hurry to the line. Now, meanwhile, yeah, they're, oh, good. He fumbled the ball. Now, you know what? He deserved that fumble because they're they're, they're bailing him out at every play. Defense comes up with the big. So that's it. I'm just going to run out the clock now. Game's over. Uh, they sure did. They got so much speed on the defensive side, and that's game's over. Now he's probably going to quit. Yeah, he quit the game. But, I mean, they, you know, like I said, they, they let that guy hang around. That game should have been over well before that fumble happened. But, I don't know. Thanks for watching. You know, you know the drill. Like, comment, subscribe. And uh, I'll see you guys next time.